Welcome to our blog. In this video, we will walk you through the process of logging into your college institutional email. This email account is an important tool for communication between students, faculty, and staff, and is often used for important announcements and updates. Additionally, it is also the primary method of contact between professors and students. To sign in, you will need your institutional email address and password. If you have forgotten your password, you can typically reset it by contacting the Internal Quality Assurance Cell or Computer Science Department of Kamakya Pemton College. We'll show you step by step how to access your email and get you up and running in no time. Let's get started. Open a web browser. Type www.kamakyapamtoncollege.ac.in. This will navigate to the college's website. Once the college website homepage loads successfully, scroll down to the bottom of the page. You will find a list of quick links. From the list, click on the link college email login. This will navigate you to the college email page. Enter your college email and password. Click on the login button. You should now be logged into your college institutional email. Inside the inbox, you will receive an email from the college with the subject feedback form. Open the mail. Once you open the mail, you will see a link that looks like this. Click on the link. And this will navigate you to the feedback form page. Once you land on the feedback form page, fill out your details. It is completely safe and anonymous. Type your name. Type your mobile number. Type your college email id. Type your college roll number. Select your course from the drop-down list. Type in which session you are currently admitted. Select in which year you are studying. Select in which semester you are studying. Click on Next button. This will navigate you to the next section, Timeline, of the feedback form. Select one option from the following list of scores, where A is excellent and scores of 5, B is very good and scores of 4, C is good and scores of 3, D is average and scores of 2, and E is poor and scores of 1. Once you complete selecting the option, then again click Next button, and will navigate you to the next section, Consciousness of Faculty, of the feedback form. Select one option from the following list of scores, where A is excellent and scores of 5, B is very good and scores of 4, C is good and scores of 3, D is average and scores of 2, and E is poor and scores of 1. Once you complete selecting the option then again click next button and will navigate you to next section, teaching methods aids of the feedback form. Select one option from the following list of scores, where A is excellent and scores of 5, B is very good and scores of 4, C is good and scores of 3, D is average and scores of 2, and once you complete selecting the option then again click next button and will navigate you to the next section, faculty attitude, of the feedback form. Once you complete selecting the option, then again click the next button and will navigate you to the final section, 
for laboratory courses of the feedback form. Select one option from the following list of scores, where A is excellent and scores of 5, B is very good and scores of 4, C is good and scores of 3, D is average and scores of 2, and E is poor and scores of 1. Once you complete selecting the option, then give other remarks or comments, then click the submit button. You will see a success message if your feedback is completed. If not, try to resubmit the feedback form.